All right, Femaflow, hit me with your best shot. Let's see what you got. Hello, everybody. It's the Dark Author here, and today we're going to be watching the Red Mist retake, a retake on the episode Bang Geeks by Femaflow. He recommended this one to me. He's been working on this one for quite some time. And I'm very interested in this one specifically because it's going off of the episode Bang Geeks, which is one of my favorite episodes of SpongeBob. And I really think if there was a way to improve um, Red Mist, base it off Band Geeks. That's how I would do it personally. So let's just get straight into it. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Turn on your bell so you'll never miss any of my uploads. And let's get straight on to the video. I'm going to full screen this. I have no idea what to expect from this. So let's see. What the fuck did I just click on? <laughs> caramel, caramel dancing, really? What, why the fuck is the jigsaw in this? What is this? <laughs> I love that song though. If only I could do the dance. Dun, 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 dun. Why is he called Fuck You Jigsaw? <laughs> okay, I think this is telling that I probably shouldn't take this one seriously. Like, this is more kind of like a joke or a parody. Because, like, what a terrific thumbnail. Oh, my God. I'm so using that for the thumbnail. I'm sorry, Femur, if it's a little embarrassing, mate, but I have to. Oh, my God, it's Hello Zep as well. I love this song, by the way, guys, from um, the first song. Actually, no, it's from nearly all the song movies. Um, Hello Zep is one of the best theme musics for a horror character. I found this spooky, haunted VHS tape in my house. My father used. Da -da -dun, da -da -da. Time to watch it, guys. It will be so scary. Yeah, oh. But I say, it's got to be a parody. 100%. Here's Band Geeks. Well, that's one thing it's got to come with my ex. Sorry, I keep pausing a lot. Here's Squilliam. Oh. What a good... That was an alright edit. Brother, Sticks! Oh god, Squidward. It's not that bad, dude. Oh, in this walk cycle, um, he showed me how he made this Femiflow did. It's pretty good, honestly, for somebody... Oh, I don't think has been doing animation for a long time, I don't think. I could be completely wrong on that. If I am wrong, please correct me, Femiflow. But still, this is actually alright. Better than anything I could cook up. There's Squidward's house. Just chilling on the bed. Wow, okay, we're not wasting any time. <coughs> Excuse me. It seems like everybody seems to be going with the flashback thing now. Yeah. I'm sorry, Squidward. Oh, Spongebob's checking on him, I think. Oh, we're not going to see his body, I'm guessing, right? Oh. No, I don't think so. <coughs> Jesus, I keep coughing. Wow. Oh, yeah. Um, Femiflow made all this, like the statue of Squidward. All this. Well, actually, no, that's from the episode Keep Bikini Bottom Beautiful, but he, like, inserted it onto here. Also, some of these fishes he admitted in the background were just recolors because he couldn't be asked to draw them, and I completely respect that. So I guess here's everybody at the funeral. Poor Squidward. He died so young. Actually, I don't know how old he is, because you guys know SpongeBob is like 30-something, like canonically. Which is pretty funny to think about that he acts so childish, yet he's actually quite old. I can see the fish are slowly beginning to leave, so I'm guessing this is like the passage of time. I mean, you gotta feel bad, honestly. Poor Squidward. The world never really gave him a chance. You know, this is an interesting take on, um... Instead of everybody just being so hateful to Squidward, 
Like, they're actually paying their respects, they're being nice. They realise that they had, like, a problem and they should have helped him with it. But yeah, everybody, pour one out for my boy, Squidward Q Tentacles. Because if you didn't know, that's his name. It has a Q in it. What does the Q stand for? I have no idea. Oh, SpongeBob. Makes sense that he's the last guy there. Yeah, I'm going to miss you, Squidward. At least there's no hyper-realistic or photorealistic stuff, so Femiflow. Good job. I approve. You get the Dark Orphan seal of approval, my friend. Aww, Squidward is a ghost. This better not be copyrighted, though, Femma. Oh, I'm coming for your way. I'm joking, but seriously. No copyright. Kids, it's not cool to steal. Um... I can't do a rhyme. I wish this was like Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog. I don't know. That's no good. There you go. That was lame. Aww. Poor SpongeBob. Um, I guess poor Squid. Oh, look at the halo. That's a cool touch. This is actually very sweet. I like this. What a good ending. I think that's the end of it. Oh, Jesus. Okay. We're going back to Hello Zep. That was so scary. If you wonder what happened to my father, basically... What? He was convicted of killing three kids. I can't believe my father can ever do that. That's got to be a coincidence. No way in hell is this connected in some way. Made by XX. Fuck you, Jigsaw. XX. I think, I think, guys, I think this was made by Fuck You Jigsaw. I don't think I can tell. Okay. Right. So that's pretty much it then. Um, I hope you all enjoyed the video. And Femiflow, this was just funny. I like this, honestly. Like, I could probably tell this was not trying to take itself seriously. But it's still good. Honestly, don't get me wrong. It is still good. So yeah, I enjoyed this, everybody, and I hope you all did too. So remember, subscribe, like, comment down below if you're new, and help me get to 2k, because if I get to 2k subs, I'll do the next big ranking video. And that'll probably be my last ranking video until my views go up on my other content. But anyways, I will see you all in the next video. Take care, my docs.